Hi there, Prairie Plant Girl here. Are you wondering what to do with your amaryllis once the blooms are withered and dried up and they're no longer flowering? It's easy. You just remove that stalk. You could use your secateurs or a sharp pair of scissors. You can compost that flower stalk and just leave them to continue growing in the nice sunny bright spot that you've had them all this time. Now, if they've only bloomed once, you might get another bloom out of them, especially if it was a good healthy bulb. But if they've already bloomed a couple of times, you're likely done getting your blooms for the season, and it's time to just let them recuperate from putting all that energy into blooming. So keep them in that sunny spot, treat them like you would any other house plant with a, you know, just consistent watering so they're not drying out completely, but they're not soggy and letting them have all that great sunshine or bright light from a grow light, whatever you use to keep your house plants living. Once you no longer have a risk of frost outside and it's staying consistently warm, I would say about, about five degrees Celsius or higher during the nighttime, then it's time that you can put your amaryllis outside. So you can leave them as a potted plant like you have them in your house, or you can put them in the ground or plant them up into a whole container. This beautiful strappy foliage is gorgeous in a mixed container. Continue to water them, continue to keep them in a nice bright sunny spot that's nice and warm, and fertilize them once in a while, you know, about once a month, just an all-purpose fertilizer is good, just to give them lots of energy to store up and get a nice big strong bulb. Before your last frost is about to happen, it's time to bring those amaryllis inside. So you can dig them up out of the ground or out of the pot or whatever soil you had them in. They don't need that anymore. And just set them down in a nice cool place. I like to put them in a small tray so they're all contained. And I just set them in my basement in a dark spot, like in a back closet or somewhere works well. Check on them once in a while. And when all this beautiful green foliage has turned yellow and withered up, it's time to cut it off. So you just snip off that old dried out foliage and just let your bulbs rest. They deserve it. They've worked hard for you this year. So once they've, once they've had that rest in a few months, you can pull them out of that cold storage and pot them up again to bloom next Christmas. So now you know what to do with your amaryllis bulbs once the flower display is over. Thanks for watching. Bye.